Hello, welcome to my channel. I will show part design tutorial in FreeCAD. I add technical drawing video below. Check video description if you want to practice FreeCAD. I have also other FreeCAD tutorials. If you want to watch them, you can check playlist video below. In this tutorial technical drawing will be on left side during video. So you can follow easily all steps. I recommend you set a latest version of FreeCAD. You can download 0.20 from FreeCAD website. This version includes many useful updates. When you start try new version, you will see differences. Now I start the drawing. Click part design from panel. Then click new button. From left top side. Click sketch button. To go to D environment. To draw left side of drawing. Select isometric view. To understand where to start of drawing. Then click wise plane. I will draw only left side. That's why I select Y and Z plane. Now I click polyline button. Then I draw randomly left view of drawing. I draw without looking dimensions. After finishing drawing firstly I will enter constraint. Then I will enter all dimension like technical drawing. You can do same drawing. Just follow how to draw it. I draw slowly following technical drawing on left side. After finishing 2D drawing, click left button of mouse. To exit polyline command. Now click constraint distance button. Then click vertical line. And enter 8 mm dimension from keyboard. I will enter the smallest dimension first. Then I will add constraints. I click horizontal constraint button from top. Then I click points to obtain horizontal constraint. As shown in video. I click left mouse to exit horizontal constraint. Then I click constraint symmetrical button. Then click points and line to make symmetrical. Now drawing becomes symmetric. Then I click right button of mouse to exit command. Now I will enter other dimensions. Click constraint button. Firstly enter 10 mm dimension. Then enter 15 mm dimension. Now click bottom line. Firstly enter 20 mm dimension. Then enter 40 mm dimension. 
on Medline. Click Constraint button again. Enter 30 mm dimension. This time click horizontal constraint button. Enter 50 mm dimension. I click constraint button. Enter 10 mm dimension and click OK. I click vertical constraint button. Enter 40 mm dimension then click OK. I click horizontal constraint button. Then click two points. Enter 80 mm dimension then click OK. Now all lines become green. This means all dimensions are completed. I can go to 3D environment. Click close to go 3D panel. Now I can start to pad here. Click pad button. And enter 50 mm length from keyboard. Select symmetric to plane. Now click middle top face. And click sketch button. To draw square. Now I click square button from top panel and draw square to middle point of sketch. Then I enter dimension. Now I click vertical distance button. And click two points of square. Then enter 20 millimeters and click OK. Click close button to go 3D panel. Then I will use pocket button to complete top side of drawing. Then click through all from pocket menu. And click OK. Now click Sketch button to draw last part. Click Y and Z plane to go 2D panel. Then I start to draw rib part. Click external geometry button and click vertical and horizontal lines as shown video. Now I click wireframe view to see clearly all lines. Then I will draw a vertical triangle of rib. Click polyline then draw vertical triangle. Now click Constraint button. Enter 20 mm dimension form keyboard. Click as is. 
to change wireframe view. Click pad button. Select symmetric plane. Enter 10 mm length. Lastly click mirror button. Select pad part from a list. And click OK to mirror part. Click OK. To exit mirror window. Mirror is completed. Part design drawing is finished. Don't forget to check below video to see technical drawing. Don't forget to subscribe my channel and like video.